Aisha El Muller joins me now. She's a member of the Local Organising Committee for IAC 2020. Aisha, thank you so much for joining us. Thank Hi. you for having me. What, what does it mean for the UAE, do you think, to be hosting IAC 2020? Uh, you know, it's uh, such a great honor to be hosting just such a prestigious event uh, in Dubai in 2020. Um, for us having this event the first time in Dubai and in the Arab world, I think it will support a lot of nations that would like to invest in the space sector. And also I think uh, it will make different parts of the world uh, get together to build a stronger industry of, of space. And for the space sector in Dubai, what do you think it will bring to that? So for the UAE, we had a vision. Uh, the UAE had a vision for the space industry, and we have a lot of investments in space. And one of them actually is the establishment of the Mohammed bin Rashid Space Center that I work in, which started back in 2006. And for us, um, starting back in 2006, we are now uh, housing the UAE National Space Program, which consists of four main pillars. We have first the UAE Satellite Development Program. So now in 25 days, we are launching our first 100% developed uh, Emirati satellite, which was built, manufactured, tested everything in Dubai, uh, launching 25 days. Uh, we have another pillar, which is the uh, UAE Astronauts Program. We are having our first Emirati astronaut joining the ISS in April 2019. Uh, we have the Mars 2117 strategy. Uh, the Mars 21 strategy is the 100-year vision or 100-year strategy to contribute in having people live on Mars or a settlement on Mars. And we also have the Emirates Mars mission, the HOPE probe. It is the first Arab uh, probe to explore Mars and uh, it will be launched in 2020 as well, reaching uh, Mars in 2021. So as you see, uh, 2020 is a very exciting and busy year for us. We have the International Astronautical Congress, we have the Emirates Mars mission launch, which will reach in 2021, marking the 50th anniversary of the UAE. And we have also the World Expo in 2020. So this is the space industry in, in the UAE uh, in a nutshell. And this is what it means for us to have the IAC in the Arab region, to have the, all the countries invest in this and getting all the world together, connecting all the, all the national, nationalities in the world. So not just for the UAE, but for the future of space as well. Why are meetings like IAC so important? These kind of events, or I'd say these kind of milestones, they create opportunities. They create opportunities for future collaborations. So these kind of things, I think, which gets the whole nation, different parts of the world, they can invest, they can develop, they can collaborate. So this is, in my opinion, I think this is what makes the science, technology and space sector stronger. Well, Aisha, thank you so much for joining us and we wish you the very best of success with IAC 2020. Thank you so much and we wish to see you in Dubai in 2020.